Congratulations to all the thousands of Nord Anglia education students who took part in Dance Unites. Dance Unites is one of the most exciting things we've done. When we did the judging today, we were astonished. What we saw was far better than we'd ever expected. Taking part in Dance Unites was um, probably a new experience for quite a lot of, of you. And it was so rewarding to hear you all talking about the way in which you'd learned new things that you'd never thought you'd be able to do. You clearly put a lot of effort into making sure your dances were practiced, rehearsed and executed perfectly. It's an important thing to do to learn to collaborate with other people. Each of you in your schools had worked with a large group of students, in some cases every student in the school, to produce a really tremendous dance. But often it was you, the students, who took the lead. You were the people who did the choreography and the design. You decided on the music. You made the videos. I was really impressed with the level of creativity and originality in your choreography and in the levels of perfection in your dance. Everybody had the same brief, everybody saw the original videos, but how you actually dealt with that was so different in every single case. We saw every style of dance performed, from traditional polkas, to hip hop, to tai chi. It was just stunning, just the whole way in which you thought to create something which was just unique for your school. It was a real privilege to see you so hard at work and producing such fantastic results. In third place, we have a tie. We have Pudong School, Shanghai, and we have Warsaw School. Congratulations. And in second place, and it was a very close second, we had difficulty in deciding between second and first. So very well done to Bratislava School. Congratulations. And the winner of Nord Anglia Education, Dance Unites, is Pushi School, Shanghai. Well done, all of you at Pushi. Congratulations. Padong. Music was one of the things we liked most about your presentation. It was so original and it fitted so well with your dance and everything that you were doing. So it's not just the dancers that make a winner. In this case, it was the back room that was equally powerful. We thought your dance had great style. We loved how you used the fans to create beautiful moves and then explore different formations and locations with them as well. We particularly enjoyed the scene in the alleyway where you had the vertical line of dancers taking the fans in the different directions. Your superb music was matched to the dance perfectly. Well done. Warsaw, your dance had fantastic energy. We loved how you mixed up the different styles from the traditional polka to hip hop and ballet. Our favorite scene was when you danced in front of the Warsaw Uprising Museum. We love seeing you dance individually. We love to see how accomplished you were in a range of different styles, again from point work to dance hall. Brilliant. One of the things that really impressed us was the way in which the whole of the Dance Unites experience had been managed by the students. It was a student-led initiative. We got a real sense of what it was like to start out on this journey for Nards Unites and what it was like to get to the end and do that fantastic dance with all of the students. So well done, Warsaw. Bratislava, your dance was emotional, atmospheric and original. The metaphor of dance as freedom was a great starting point for some very thoughtful and inventive choreography. We loved how you used the repressed mechanical movement done in unison to represent communism. We loved the trio of girls showing how you were breaking free. And a real favorite moment was the tunnel of dancers. Your submission was really all about the story, about the struggle for Bratislava's freedom. And it was really quite emotional. You did it so well. We were all impressed by the inclusivity from the IB students taking the lead in terms of thinking, right through to the very youngest students in the school dancing. It was a family effort at Bratislava. 
a powerful, almost iconic kind of image of Bratislava and its freedoms. Pushi, you really were well-deserved winners. Everything about your submission was stylish and it was quality all of the way. From the report about how you went about creating your dance and why, right through to the way in which you did your filming. But of course, it was the dance itself that stole the show. So much practice must have gone into creating that. Nothing was left to chance. Nothing phased you. And that really was what impressed us. It was very much a credit to each and every one of you and to your school. Well done. You excelled in every area. You took old and new Shanghai and you fed it through the choreography, the locations and the costumes. Your choreography was original, unique and very, very clever. You used different formations, imagery, gesture, different levels, different speeds and it was fantastic. The first scene in the park showing the old Shanghai was really beautiful. Taking the Tai Chi and then developing it and then the scene in the underground was just so clever. How you used dance to show that you were a bunch of commuters holding on, checking the time, jostling and bustling with each other. It was just brilliant. Wherever you danced, you drew crowds of onlookers and rightly so, you were fantastic. And it's not just us who have been impressed by your dances. The internationally famous choreographer Arlene Phillips has got a few words to say too. Congratulations to all the students at Nord Anglia Education Schools who have taken part in Dance Unites in association with Pineapple Studios. Well done and congratulations once again to you all. What a day it was. Our students dancing in countries all over the world. So very well done absolutely everybody. It was great.